there's not much more to say really, is there? That's it. Video over. Oh. No, I'm joking. We are going to jump in. Yes, I know. It's been a bit crazy around here with unboxings lately, but it's all going to come to a very abrupt stop very soon, but not yet. So stick around. <laughs> Hi everybody and welcome back. Yes, we have a double unboxing today. I've been a very bold girl. Very bold. These fingers have been very bold. I gotta tell you, that's that's bolder than this robe I'm wearing. I mean, that is incredible. <laughs> so, before we get into this double unboxing, what is inside? Comment down below. You guys are great at the guessing. I love this game. It's brilliant crack. And some of the comments in my last video about my top were very funny as well. I didn't take offense. It's gone to the charity shop and we're back to Beautiful white, crisp, clean, fit well, nice material, all the rest. Watch my last video if you don't know what I'm talking about. <laughs> now, today's shout out is to the beautiful Anna Butt. Mwah. Hello Anna, how are you? And the fragrance of today is Musk Ravageur by Frederick Mal. This is a lavender bergamot tangerine in the top notes. She has cinnamon and clove in the middle notes. Then coming down, she has a vanilla musk powdery kind of a third kind of base and at the very end she's got woody so she's a warm spicy amber musky powdery cinnamon aromatic sweet lavender phrase she's punchy all my fragrances are pretty punchy she's a sex bomb Frederick Mal, he knows how to do it well. This is a small little version and she is, she'd be a special occasion kind of perfume if you're going somewhere special. She's a seductor, this one. She's very, very beautiful. Now, yes, two unboxings today. Viv, what has happened to you in the last couple of weeks? Well, yes, my fingers have been busy. Yes, I have sold a lot of bags and these bags have been on my mind for a very long time, particularly one. The other one was, I couldn't resist moment. Have you ever had that? I just couldn't resist. I'm so curious, I can't resist. And then the colors, oh my God. I don't know, I think I've stepped out of my safe, warm space of basically neutrals and I'm, I'm going mad with the colors here. So there's a big hint. Now, what will we do? Will we do the first one or the second one? Will we start with the small one? Let's start with the big one. Let's just be bold and start with the big one. Now, I got these delivered just today, so I'm specially filming this today for you guys, and so that I can open them. Let's be honest here. Obviously. So inside, and they are unbelievable, came from Florence by DHL, and they came in big boxes, and they came in the bags, presented just like this. So Fendi, pretty amazing in fairness. This box was in this bag, and it was del delivered like that. So, you know, fair juice to Fendi in fairness to them. So this is my first unboxing. And what's inside? As I said, in this beautiful little box. So, oh my God, I've already, look what I've done. I've already given a big, huge hint, so you probably know what it is. It is small. And then we have all the details in here. And it's card, it's authenticity, blah, blah, blah. We'll just put that aside just for a little second to reveal, ladies and gentlemen, there's a little card. Can I present to you Miss Fendi Nano Peekaboo with the maxi handle. Ha ha ha, stop it, stop it. And actually Cassie Thorpe, this is your fault. I saw your yellow nano maxi handle and I thought, oh my God, that is divine. And I like small little bags as well. You know, TBEs I love because I don't need to carry a lot. This, I don't know, might carry my AirPods. It might carry a, a lip gloss and that might be it. We might do a little what fits in a few minutes. Now, I did open this little beauty just before I filmed because I wanted to see if everything was okay. I, I'll, I'll be very honest now, right? I will be very honest. This beauty price and all, I'll be giving you that in a couple of seconds. I thought it was gonna come with gold hardware. The maxi handle comes in different colors. She comes in black, white, yellow, like an amber yellow. She comes in a green, pink, purple, and most of them are gold hardware. The only pal palladium hardware is on the light blue and on, I think it's the green. Yeah, it's the green. So now I thought this was going to come. My little fingers got way too fast and ahead of themselves. And I pressed add to cart, purchase. Here's my, swipe my card. It's too cute. I need it. I can't resist. I love it. 
and I adore it and look, I mean, it's just gorgeous. I had actually purchased an ICU. This actually came in three different kind of styles over the last a couple of years. It came in the Petite Micro, which was the softer. This one is a lot wider. They had another one which was thinner again, but it came with a gold, kind of flimsy gold chain. And this one, as you would have seen from my reveal, comes with a beautiful blue leather strap, which is detachable and adjustable. So you can wear it cross body, wear it under the bouvage, you can wear it where you like, and it's got the silver hardware. As I said, it is detachable, so that is a great. It looks a little bit more substantial, I think, in the leather, because the little gold was very flimsy. She's got the beautiful little Fendi rings on her here, with the Fendi embossed in it, and she has got the little turn lock. I'm, I'm just gonna take this out just for a little second. And the little card. And she like closes just like any other little normal little Fendi. And you turn the lock and there is your little beauty. I mean, she is just too cute. Now, my question to you guys is, what do you think? I mean, I just wanted the blue because I don't have any blues in my collection. She is of course the Napa leather and uh, she's just absolutely gorgeous. As I said, she's a new size. The others were the Nano Peekaboo. It was last year's, it was a lot thinner and all the rest of it. And this one's more substantial and a lot wider. It's more like the Peekaboo ICU. There's also the Fendi Peekaboo Petite. And the beauty about this little one is she actually, you can detach her, but have I learned how to do that yet? But we're learning, we're learning. This actually little handle, look at this, watch, you have a little, little button right here. And she just, opens like so. So you can add her to any other like bags that you have and use her as a bag charm. She'll fit a lip gloss, no problem. Right in she goes, a little lip gloss. You're off to the lunch, you're off to the beach, you're off to wherever you're off to. But just in case, you might like to, you can put your AirPods inside. Now, she will, she has a little snap closure on one side and she has the uh, turn lock on the other side. Look at her, she's just a little beauty. So I'm just going to attach her back and onto the top there like so. She's attached back on the little the little nano handle there and she's just adorable. My question to you guys is, should I change her for a gold hardware? A lot of my stuff has the gold hardware. I tend to go for the gold hardware. My choices would be the yellow, the purple or the white with gold hardware or to keep this beauty. Let me know down below. I am betwixt and between, as you know, I have a few bags with palladium hardware, my Birkin 25 being one of them, my Evelyn 16 being another, and so I don't know. I just really love the blue. What do you think? Do you think I should change it for the gold or what? I'm not sure. So to close it, you just flick the switch back up like that, and then you can attach your beautiful, whoops, your beautiful little straps onto the side here and i think she's gorgeous look at her she's just absolutely doughty she's de definitely tbe i love the fact that she's a completely different color to anything else that i have in my collection and as you can see you can adjust the strap here and look at her i'm just going to pop her over here now just for a sec now at this stage because i haven't done anything that is how much strap i have left all of that and i definitely would need it because she's under my boob there at the moment and I like it a little bit longer and I'm going to just let her down a little bit and see how much she comes down on me. I'm 175 centimeters so we come down to the second last loop. So I'm five foot nine, yes, and that comes right down to my waist and see, there, waist, there. So that actually works so much better for me and just gorgeous on holidays, hands free, off you go. I think she's absolutely gorgeous. But as I said, will I change her for the, the yellow or the gold hardware? Let me know what you guys think. I would love to know. I would love to know what you guys think. Now, moving on to the smaller box. That one was a little bit of a, a tease. It was a big box, but it was a tiny bag. Now what's in this one? Can we guess? Here we go for the second reveal. Yes, I've lost my tiny little mind a little bit, but do you know what? I just thought, oh my God, these colors are divine. They're the new season kind of colors and they'll go quickly. Actually, some of the, even the little nano bags, they were sold out and you couldn't get the colors, particularly the pink. Thank God, I, I just didn't want the pink to be honest with you anyway, but today let me present number two, Fendi unboxing in said box. What is inside? Let us open her up. And da, 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 da. Hello, 
and welcome to the family. Inside we have, well, you're just going to do it this way now because it's easier. Can you guess? Any guesses down below? You can guess. Inside, ladies and gents. Wow, my God. This one is a showstopper. Showstopper, right? May I present the Fendi Mini Baguette. Oh my God. It's like an acid green. It's like an apple green. I thought it was a mint and it is a stunner. Look at it with the gold hardware, Napa leather, the embossed textured leather. It's about seven and a half inches across. It's got two handles, the top handle, the cross body handle. I'm gonna attach that now. And it attaches here, as you can see, with two separate attachments. Unbelievable, it is amazing. I just love the color of this bag. You know I'm in my green phase. I don't know what's going on with me with greens, but anyway. She comes also again in the black, in the white. She comes in a pink, in a purple. This is the green, obviously, and a peachy pink and a pink. That's what she comes in. An absolute beauty. Now, I have been eyeing this particular one. This is the leather, she's so soft. Oh my God, she's actually so soft and squishy and just tactile. I was eyeing her in the FF embossed, but I have this beauty, okay? That, by the way, even though I was watching on Dale's video, you can just attach her to her big sister here. Now I'll take off the strap later. I won't be doing that now. And that was just a strap I got, I think from dress up my purse. But you can attach her like that. You can have big sister and little sister hanging out for the day. We'll take off this just for effect. And so yes, I was looking at the mini in the FF logo um, and I thought to myself, the jacquard, and I thought to myself, well Viv, now you have the little micro one, which I love. I actually used this on holiday last year loads of times, running down the beach and whatever else. And I said, you have that. Just go for the pop of color and go for the leather. Because I hear that the canvas can be quite flimsy as well. So I said, I'll go for the leather and I'll go for the pop of color. And am I sorry? No, oh, I love her. She's just gorgeous. She has that vintage antique gold, the double FF clasp. Look at this for a magnetic, watch. Like, look, she just literally like, the, like closes herself, you know? Like, you don't have to do anything. She's just gorgeous. The stuffing in there now is disturbing her a little bit. How pretty is this color? Now, the price is, actually I never gave you the price of the little blue one. The little blue Nano with the maxi handle is 1,350 euro. Yeah, you know, it's not cheap. And this beauty is 1,850 euro on the website. And the fuller size one is then 2,900. So there's about a thousand euro difference. This is the perfect size for me. As I've said to you before, I don't carry that much. I will show you in a sec what it fits inside. So you have the softest leather and we will take out the little stuffing here. And inside, oh, I just love her. I love her, Fendi, you're just amazing. I swear to God, like, I, like I'm falling back in love. I had a few Fendi bags years ago and I sold them, but I'm definitely falling back in love with Fendi. Three card slots on the inside, the kind of material inner lining and the soft na Nappa leather. Now inside, all I ever care about, and I think all we all care about is does she fit my phone with the cover on? And <laughs> so that's not going to be a problem. Mine is the 11 Pro Max. No problem with space. And then if you wanted just a slim kind of a uh, key ball or hold on, I'd use my O case. Just for my liquids, like my lip glosses, things that might spill over, I will pop it in there. Now, if you're not happy with that, ladies and gents, you can pop your, eye, your earphones in there, ear pods even. Oh, I've left them in there, haven't I? And then your key holder in the front. Right, now I have card holders and everything else. Not that I would need it. I would actually, it, that works perfectly. I will close it down for you now. I can't wait to use this bag. That's always a good sign. I cannot wait to use this bag. Oh, look at her. I mean, there is no stretch on the side. Just perfect. And what I've heard actually about the bigger one, you see this gap here. There's a much bigger gap where your eyeliners, lip glosses and things fall out. You don't have that in the mini. And she just feels so sturdy and so substantial. 
and so well made and so beautiful. The stitching and the aligning and everything is just incredible. I just am so, so happy. Look at her, she's a beauty. Let me see now, if we take out this, because I don't carry this all the time, I just carry my keys in my hand or whatever. Um, I will take out the O case, I don't carry that. I would generally maybe carry, if I didn't want to use the card slots in the back, I'll carry my little card holder by Chanel in there, my phone, and I would stick a lip gloss here down the side. My lip gloss is up here in this one, but like, believe you me, it fits. So you've got lots of different options. You can swap around between a little thin card holder, that would fit in there as well. Your little Louis Vuitton key pouch would also fit. And do you know what I'm gonna try now, just for the laugh, I'll take out my card holder, I'll take out my phone, and I will stick in the Louis Vuitton mini pochette. And, stop, look, yes incredible and i'll still put my phone in behind that so that if you're popping out anywhere just so that you know yeah do you know what Viv? that fits no problem absolutely no problem now there's no pocket or anything on the back who cares we don't need a pocket she is she packs a punch as they say there's your mini pochette and your phone inside and you have everything organized she can use her as your bag insert your bag organizer whatever you like and that is herself oh my god i am Loving this bag. Cannot wait to wear her. She'd be gorgeous with white. She'd be gorgeous with blue. I think green and blues, even denims, are absolutely gorgeous. Green and bright pink are beautiful together. I'm going to style it with that. And they are my two new little beauties. Oh my God, even together. Look, look, look. To me, that's beautiful. I'm all about the color. It must be the phase I'm in in my life. I'm just not sure what's going on. <laughs> Thrilled, thrilled, thrilled. Let me know. I'd love to hear your comments on whether I should swap out this for a gold hardware piece, which would be in either the amber yellow, the purple, or the white. Yeah, they're the three colors I think I would go for with the gold. Or will I stick with my blue with palladium hardware? Light blue, baby blue? It's kind of like blue broom. Let me know. Okay, guys, that's it. I'm a happy bunny today. I'm going out particularly and specially just to the shop to wear my handbags. Okay, so if you see a mad woman walking around with 10 handbags on her, it's, it's probably me. Okay, okay. So that's it. Until next time, love you lots. Can't wait to talk to you. Subscribe, comment, like, all of the rest of it. And of course, be kind, be safe, be compassionate. Love you lots, guys. Mwah.